Good morning, split stance, elbows to target. If you're an adult gymnastics skill seeker looking to improve your pike flexibility or progress on your head to toe stretch, this split stance, elbows to target, good morning, is for you. I like to use this exercise as a mobility and structural balance drill as it allows us to compare the left and right side range of motion. A prerequisite to this exercise is performing a split stance good morning while maintaining a flat back with the torso parallel to the floor. Once you accomplish this, you can start training the elbows to target variation. Start by building a target that you can touch the elbows to. A stack of weight plates or yoga blocks is a good option. Next, stand with the feet in a heels to toe format. The toes of the front foot are touching the target and the toes of the back foot are touching the heel of the front foot. From here, rotate the back foot 90 degrees on the heel so the toes are pointing out to the side. Then turn the back foot 90 degrees on the ball of the foot so the toes are facing forward again. This setup allows us to create exactly the same position in each set. During this exercise, we must keep as much weight on the front foot as possible. Keep the front knee locked, touch both elbows to the target and focus on the anterior pelvic tilt, APT. Place your hands behind your head and bring the elbows forward in front of the face. Start by contracting the quad of the front legs and pulling the kneecap up to lock the knee and keep the front legs straight. The back knee is allowed to bend. Next, hinge at the hips by sitting the hips back and reaching the elbows forward. The goal is to keep the weight balanced over the front foot as you move the pelvis into an anterior pelvic tilt. Focus on lifting the tailbone while using the hip flexors to pull the front of the pelvis down. Another helpful cue is to think about pulling the front leg into the back of the hip capsule as you keep the spine long and lean the torso forward and down. You want to use your hip flexors and lower abdominals to pull you into the good morning. Think about closing the angle between your thigh and your belly. Aim to maintain a, aim to maintain a flat back until the torso is parallel to the floor. Once you've reached this point, start to round the back and sink deeper into the forward fold until both your elbows touch the target. Once the elbows touch down, lean the torso forward to increase the stretch. Can you stack your hips vertically above the heel of the front foot? At the same time, you must contract the hip flexors and actively push the elbows down into the target. We're not just touching the target, we're trying to push down into the target. Hold this active isometric contraction for 10 to 20 seconds before reversing the movement and standing up straight. As flexibility increases, you can lower the target with the goal of touching your elbows to the floor. In this video, I'm performing three reps with a 10 second active isometric hold at the bottom of each rep. Give it a try and see how you go. If you've got questions, please leave them in the comments. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel.